Uh, I'm John Zeisman, Professor Emeritus here at Berkeley and uh, co-director of the Berkeley Roundtable on the International Economy. Uh, I've been asked to mention that, in fact, some of what we're doing with all this fits into projects at IGS in the, the project that Jack Citrin is, in fact, launching with, I'm trying to help, on California and the global economy, uh, part of which is also focused on issues of what we're calling working, earning, learning uh, in the age of the intelligent machine, which uh, we're doing with Laura Tyson, Shankar Costas Panos, who's building this now is, as it were, and Ken Goldberg. Uh, that said, we're focusing here on the question of investing in higher education, research universities, innovation, and their economic impact. And we have four fabulous uh, presenters, and then we'll open things out to discussion. Uh, the presenters first are uh, Professor Martin Kenny from UC Davis, uh, who's worked on these issues for an extremely long time and very usefully, whose book, Public Universities and Regional Growth, is just one, this particular book is just one of a set of things. Martin is both editor at uh, Research Policy and runs the Stanford University Press series on Silicon Valley. He's going to tell us the truth. Then, in fact, uh, Deej, uh, whose last name I can never pronounce, but who is, we're very grateful. Uh, we got an all-star. We traded for an all-star. This is the Kevin Grant trade of academics, right? So who, in fact, in the past has both been the found professor of molecular biology and chemistry here, uh, founded a company that was bought by Amgen, much to his pleasure, I'm sure, uh, and ran the Howard Hughes Medical Institute before coming back here and uh, therefore obviously can uh, discuss some of the areas in the bio areas. Uh, he's going to tell us, uh, he claims some of the lies that in fact we need to know. And Pradeep Kosla, who's chancellor at uh, UC San Diego, was dean of engineering at um, Carnegie Mellon previously. And San Diego, of course, is the uh, icon of the ability to have an impact on one's community and to build a research university in a useful way. Uh, and Pradeep claims that he's going to tell us fake facts. You know, <laughs> and then we're going to leave it to Sean Randolph to sort out what the fake facts are uh, from the true facts and to all of you to join in a conversation as we try and really understand how uh, the university system uh, can contribute to economic growth and fit into the needs and problems and uh, responsibilities of the community. Uh, with that, what we're going to do is each of the speakers will have about 10 minutes. Uh, Martin Kenny will start, um, and he's going to do some version of a slide presentation, and I believe the others will uh, uh, simply wave their hands. So uh, with that, Martin.